go. Welcome back to Jenna's Kitchen. You need to make sure you get in enough fruit this season and the cantaloupes in store are really good right now. Plus, my family loves them. So I'm gonna show you an easy way to cut up a cantaloupe. The first thing that you want to do is wash your cantaloupe because this did come from a field and it's just a good idea to wash your fruits and vegetables. Give it a good scrub, get in all the ridges. Now you want to dry off your cantaloupe once you've washed it. Now it's ready to be cut. Alright, now that our cantaloupe is washed and dried, we're going to take a knife, cut it down the middle, but here's a little trick. Put a wet paper towel under your cutting board so it doesn't move as much when you are cutting this rounded melon here. Take your knife, get, judge where the center is, and cut. Now we're going to take a spoon and scrape the seeds out from the center of the melon. You can put this in your compost, but I'm going to give it to my chickens. This is looking good. I'm going to do the same thing with this hat. We're going to set this one like this. Take one of our halves, take the knife, and just cut the top part off. I have a paring knife, and I'm just going to cut the skin off of the candle, like this want any green left on your melon because that's bitter and hard and you just you don't want it. I've gotten all the skin off but as you can see there's still some green so just make sure you get all that off. Now that we have all of the green and the skin off of our melon we're gonna cut it in half. Cut it, the halves in half, twist it, cut it in half again, cut the halves in the half. All right, then you're going to flip this on its side. You're going to take one of these, flip it on its side, cut it in half. And then voila, here are some cantaloupe cubes. Now this might be a little big. If you want to cut it up more, you can, but this is about the size that I like it. Put these cantaloupes in our bowl and repeat the process. I and repeat the process with this half. Now I like this process because I don't feel like I'm wasting as much of the cantaloupe as opposed to when you cut it in half and then cut it in slices, but you can totally do that if you want to and you feel more comfortable that way but this to me is just easier. Here's the cantaloupe that we cut up today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Cantaloupe is so great. You can make it so many different ways. You could just cut it up like this, eat it cold, eat it warm, eat it in like make your own bowl of ice cream, like cut it in half, dig out the seeds, put some ice cream in it, and then you have your own bowl and it's so good. Or you can make my sparkling cantaloupe drink that I made. It's delicious, perfect for upcoming summer days. Don't forget to subscribe to Jenna's Kitchen, share this video with your cantaloupe loving friends, and have a great day.